In this video, let's see another IITJ numerical problem which was asked in the year 2003 for one mark and it was based on the topic of matrices. We already have seen few problems and this video is in succession to those previous problems. Let's see what the question has to say and let's get started with the solution. The question is if A is equal to a given matrix which has elements alpha 0 1 1 and B has also some elements say 1 0 5 1 then what value of alpha will give me A square is equal to B. That means you are supposed to find out the value of alpha and you know a condition that alpha 0 1 1 and 1 0 5 1 is given to me. Let's write the heading as solution and we'll be starting with the solution within a fraction of seconds. So solution is the heading and I have to use the knowledge of a square is equal to b. Let's write it as a square is equal to b. Now what is a square? You have to find out. You already know the value of a. Alpha 0 1 1 is a. Alpha 0 1 1 is a. But a square means multiplying by a two times. So it is multiplication of alpha 0 1 1 again and that whole thing is equal to the matrix B. What is matrix B? It is 1 0 5 1. So it is 1 0 5 1. Now what are we supposed to do? We are supposed to multiply and then equate and compare. So first row first column, first row first column that makes it what? Alpha into alpha is alpha square. 0 into 1 is 0. Similarly, first row and second column, alpha into 0 is 0, 0 into 1 is 0, so it is 0. Second row, first column, so it is alpha plus 1 and second row, second column, so it is 1 zero are 0 and 1 ones are 1, so it is 1. This is not 2 alpha, this is alpha square. Let's make 2 a bit small and in the power so as not to get confused. This is alpha square. Now, it is equal to 1, 0, 5, 1. What is our next task? Our next task is to compute and compare. So, alpha square is here and here we have 1. So, that means alpha square is equal to 1. And next condition related to alpha is alpha plus 1 here and here it is 5. So alpha plus 1 is 5. Now you need to have a single value of alpha which would having the answer either from 1, minus 1 or 4 or no real values. Can it be 1 and minus 1 or 4? We need to see it. Since there are two equations and only one variable, we need to get an answer which satisfies both the equations. If you see equation number 2, if it, this is 1, this is 2 and if you see equation number 2, you have alpha is equal to 5 minus 1 which is 4. But if you put that 4 value here, 4 square is equal to 16 and it is not equal to 1. So at any time, you don't have any real value which satisfies both the equations. So my answer cannot be option number A or B or C because there is no fixed value. But the answer to this question is option number D which is no real values because there is not any single value of alpha which satisfies both the equations simultaneously. 